Chad Smith. We're at one of Andrea's favorite silk shops. Antico Santificio Fiorentino. Well done, well done. Ah, <laughs> that's all the Italian I know. Petuccini, ravioli. Yeah, it's good, it's good. It's the first thing you have to learn. Of so course. welcome to the Antico Santificio Fiorentino. Well said from you. Oh, much better for you. Thank you. And also welcome to the Rio Florence because we are in the other side of the river. You can find the craftsmanship in this neighborhood. In the past, was all over the city. Nowadays, you only can find it this side. And now I invite you to come to the factory. Thank you, Brita. Okay, so this is our factory. <laughs> it's quite impressive because it's the same way it was uh, when it was established in the 1786. Yes, and the looms that we're going to see in the end are even older than that. So the first room is this over here. So this is one of the most special things we do here is the fact that we produce the threads ourselves. So the yarn is being positioned in this machine. Uh, the colors, uh, they're dyed by request. Every client can customize their fabric, so they choose the color they want to. What would happen if I put my finger in there? I will probably beat you. <laughs> Here is our warping room. We have two warping machines. The first one you are looking at, that's quite a penultimate machine. Uh, it's very special for us because uh, it's a machine that was designed by Leonardo da Vinci. Oh, that guy again. He's all over the place. <laughs> so just so you can see, one of the, um, the most beautiful fabrics they do here is this uh, fabric we call Ermizino. Ermizino. Ermizino, well done. The, um, the Ermizino has two beautiful things. The first thing, as you can see, it changed colors with the light. Yeah, psychedelic. Yes. And uh, exactly. <laughs> and the other thing is this uh, wow. fabric, it has a memory. So if I put it in a shape, it stays. <laughs> wow. So imagine that this kind of fabric you see in many Renaissance paintings, uh, this fabric was used especially for the sleeves of the dresses by the time. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. And it have a beautiful light on it. You know, one of the, of the reasons Andrea loved this place oh, yeah. is because of the sound. Yeah, the rhythm, like the sound, is great. Yeah, it's absolutely. like a symphony when you get here during the day. And, and the one's doing this sound, exactly. one and this different rhythm. It's yeah, really cool. similar to music, somehow. Okay, so if you look up, this is one of the famous hand looms donated from the families in the 1700s. Okay, sh show me how, you, how you're doing it. Okay. So you get the full leg, okay, yeah, yeah. Down. Down, yeah. and then pull the string. Oh, she got that thing. Over to the right, and then pull, and your leg goes up. I'll try. <laughs> it's gonna be my new job. <laughs> okay, so first, wow, this is like first down. Oh, whoop, down, and then over. No. Oh, this way. Ah, oh, sorry. Did I screw it up? I broke it. I broke it. It's okay. It's only from the 1600s. Up. Up. Oh. Tight. Down. This, this looks perfect. I mean. Do I get the, do I get the job? I don't think so. 